Well, this should be a fun one on the ice tonight. Hi, everybody. I'm James Sabalski for EA Sports as we get set to drop the puck on a little hut. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Nailers will look to go on the offensive as they win the opening draw. And he takes the dish. Jostling for the puck and he loses control. Feeds it to Kuzmenko. Cuts to the paint. And that ricochets off a twig in front. Pushes it across to Jarvis. The Nailers gain control of the puck. Quick feed to McDavid. That's blocked. Picked up along the wall by McDavid. Carolina's regained possession of the puck. Blocker saved by Nedeljkovic. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves. Here they come on the attack. Oh, break out the ice packs. He lays out to block that shot. Ow. From a tight angle, throws it on this. Scores. Trent Burns. Well, the goaltender, he's going to want this one back, James. I thought that he was set to position. Just... The blast of the shot, it hit him. He got a good chunk of it, but it went in. You can see the frustration in the body language. Carolina's hard work pays off as they get on the board first here tonight. Yeah, getting on the board first over halfway through the first period. And, you know, there hasn't been much going on here in this game. It's been back and forth, but it's starting to open up with this first goal. Gotta hope that there's some more offense in this game. The score! And that's back-to-back snipes! Well, it feels like there's a wave of momentum, and it has certainly changed here. You can get the opportunity, but you have to execute. That's two in a row. This is an incredible move to the backhand, James, to be able to beat the goaltender, but I also love the spatial awareness, knowing exactly where he is on the ice and how much time he has to make that move. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Hurricanes have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Pokes the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Shea. Moves it to Ajo. Slides the puck over to Tara Vinen. Lays into the body on the play. And that's stolen by Shea. Carolina's on the attack. Broken up by Ellis. Hammers a shot, and that's turned aside by Price. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Carolina's got a hold of the puck now. Slides it over with pace to punting. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We've got a delayed penalty coming up. The Nailers are being called for tripping. will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, they've earned their first power play of the game. A tone setter right here and an opportunity to look at the coverage on the setup. Great hits up play with the stick by Sackick. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Ajo's used by his coaches to win those face-off matchups, guys. That's his quick draw zone ability, and it's how he contributes to his team's overall possession game. Carolina's won it, now they'll go on the attack. And that goes off a stick and off to the side. He's got a step! Oh, and he's taken down! Penalty coming up! Well, he makes a great play, and he's in all alone on the breakaway, and then he gets tripped up, James. This is definitely a penalty shot.
Rackick's got the puck, and here he comes. Shot! Scores! Oh, the excellence of execution. He was perfect on that. Well, he knew what he was going to do, and I think so much of it comes down to confidence, not overthinking of it, and when the time comes, just being patient enough to pull it off. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. Carolina's won the draw. Receives the pass. Centering feed. Oh, and he keeps it here. With possession along the wall. Oh, tremendous save on the play. What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Carolina's got it on the line. The Hurricanes certainly didn't get the result they wanted on that power play, giving up a shorthanded marker. Sometimes when you're on a power play, you can get caught cheating. And I think you have a lot more time than you do, and it winds up in the back of their net. That's a tough one. The Nailers have it now. Lozon's got it in the defensive end. Takes it into the slot. Oh, what a stick save. Loses his balance on the play. Here he is with the backhander. Puck grabbed by Burns. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. The Nailers gain control of the puck against the wall. All alone. Oh, what a save on the play. Well, James, I think he might have gotten in too tight here when he was selling the fake, but a nice save by the goaltender. And they send it right back to him. And nearing the final 60 seconds of this opening stanza. Carolina's got it in their own zone. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Slides the puck across to Ellis. And with the buzzer, that puts a bow on the first 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here. And the official seems about ready to drop the puck on period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? The Nailers didn't get off to a great start at all. I mean, they've been chasing the game, and the real reason why they're behind in this one, they haven't had any possession time. Carolina's got the puck. Burns takes it along the wing. The Nailers pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Taken by Burns. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. The Nailers are doing a great job of anticipating the play, and that's why the puck is on their stick. They're intercepting pucks all game long. They've got to make good on them. They've got to transfer it, head north, and start cashing in. A chance! And that shot gets caught in traffic. Here's a chance! Gets in front of the shot. Grabbed along the boards by Slavin. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. It's 2-1. Puck picked up by Ellis. Quick pass to Lindstrom. The Nailers take it along the wing. Picked up here in the neutral zone by Shea. The Hurricanes will take it behind the net. able to ruin his opponent's attack plan by using his stick to make defensive plays in his own end, guys. His stick-em-up zone ability means he can poke check effectively and play solid D. Oh, how did that stay out? It goes up the inside of the post. The Hurricanes recognize that they have the lead. Scores! The 
you see the torque on that stick? I mean, imagine if we got a freeze frame. It would have been bent. Almost looked like it could have snapped in half off of that quick release snapshot. Carolina's on a roll tonight. Now they've extended the lead to two. They're on a roll, and you can see it in their body language, the way they're communicating on the bench. When you're winning and you're feeling it, everything's alive. Oh, textbook hip check. He got all of that one. I'm not sure if he was ready for that hit, James, because he went down in a hurry, and it was hard. Now he's laboring. He's really struggling to get back to the bench where the trainers are waiting for him. And he rings the post. The Nailers trying to shrink their deficit, but it won't get done there as they wire it off the pipe. Swing and a miss. Scooped up along the wall by Bunting. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Sends it in front. Picked off in front. The Nailers move it in. Break away. Score! Execution. That's how you do it. The Nailers needed that, Cheryl, and they seem to have some life now. Well, they've shortened the deficit, and there's nothing better to get you back in the game than one goal to put themselves on their toes. But again, they're going to have to have an attack mentality if they want to get an equalizer. Puck said down the ice. We'll get an icing. Past the halfway mark of this period. The Nailers still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Ozone faceoff, James. Critical time to gain possession with that clean win, and for the tired group, they get that puck moving around and a real opportunity on net. Oh, a huge hit against the wall, and you know well, and that's a tone setter. That's sending a message to every player on your team. Get involved physically. Pay the price. Use your body and get the puck. Quick pass to Burns. And that goes off course off a of body. The Nailers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Taken along the wall by McCabe. Puck scooped up by Verhage. Under a minute to go here inside the second period. Takes a shot. Big time club save by Nedeljkovic. That's a fantastic save, James. I and mean, you got one of the greatest shooters in the league in terms of their snapshot. I mean, he almost snaps his... And he hangs on just as time runs out. Well, there you go. 40 minutes in the books. All right, friends. Go grab yourself some water. Get hydrated. And then buckle up because we got an exciting third period coming up in moments. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. All right, the puck is dropped on the third and final frame. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. The Nailers are right where they should be in this game, James, and that is behind entering the third period. Why? They just haven't had the puck. It hasn't been on their stick, which means they haven't been able to generate anything offensively. Icing is the call. We'll get a face-off at the other end. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Just one goal separating these two teams as we sit with a 3-2 lead. Stalls, quick stick off the draw, wins possession. Huge win by the center to give his team an opportunity to get out of the zone after a critical icing. Coughs up the puck after that hit. The Nailers gain possession. Oh, textbook put check to turn that over. Dumped into the cross side. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. And now it's grabbed by Martinuk. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. 
Moore's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Oh, and he throws a perfectly executed hip check there. Here's a short pass to Dreisaitl. Denies him! Nedeljkovic is able to deny that scoring chance right from the slot area, James. That's a beautiful one. Lays into the body. Moves the puck. Carolina's top line has been just that tonight. They've contributed offensively, and they're a reason they're in the lead. Oh, what a save by Price! Here's a chance in front! What a chance, but they can't connect! Moves it quickly over to Dreisaitl. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. On the attack along the boards. Oh, great save right there on the play. Quick feed to Tara Vinen. The Nailers gain possession. Takes the feed. Takes the pass. Cuts to the front. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to sweat it away. He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. From the half wall, a chance! A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Eichel's won the draw here in their own zone. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Moves it to Solani. Oh, and he delivers a thunderous hit check. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. This is the best part of the game. It's really tight. It's down the stretch. One mistake. I Big time save. Oh, my goodness. Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. And as play continues, listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud and recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. Hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board, and guess what? The goaltender knows it. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this... and keep their opponent at bay. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, denies him with the paddle save! Slip feed. Carolina's got a hold of the puck. Oh, and here comes the boom! Oh, he's known for this, James. He is a... Scores! We're tied! We're tied! We're tied! Dying seconds of the third, James, and they were so urgent all around the puck, aggressive, pounding it, and they found the back of the net. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Carolina's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Quick pass to Carolina. Scores! And we take a drive to Crush City as they take the lead! Well, the lead is in their hands, and now it's about building off of that. Good shift management, dictating pace, controlling the offensive zone. Everything now is on the line. The Nailers coaching staff has to be frustrated. Their players have played well tonight, but they just can't finish on some of these chances, and we're running out of time late in the third. That's all she wrote from this one tonight. The Hurricanes equipment staff may have actually put a layer of glue on their sticks tonight. They may just continue to dominate the puck all night. Yeah, they were in control of the game, and their opponent was chasing it, and they just got worn down shift after shift. And you know what? They were also urgent with the puck. Sometimes you can get static, and you can just get lulled and lofted into the perimeter, but they didn't. They weren't afraid to attack. 